Hi YouTube, um, I've just been doing the painting stages on the Gremlin. Um, this is the second painting stage, so I'm just going to show you what I've been doing. Um, if you have a look down here, now probably at first glance he looks the same as he did in the last video. Um, do you remember I painted him a really dark colour before? Um, what I've done since then is dry brush. Um, so if I zoom in a little bit, you can see. Okay, so there's this slightly lighter colour over the top. It's all dry brushed over everything. Um, and what that does is it, it just makes all the cracks show up as really dark. And then you get the lighter colour over the top. Can you see on the top here? Okay, so although it's quite subtle, um, it's making a difference overall, I think. If you have a look at some of these leg scales here. Yeah, so it just gives it like a sort of a, a slight shine effect um, and it just brings out some of the highlights. Um, I will be obviously going lighter still, but I just wanted to show you this stage um, before I do the, um, the sort of cream colour in the ears and on the chest and that sort of thing. Um, so if you have a look at my plate here of paint, I don't know if you can see the colour difference. So that, that was my first colour that I put on, quite a bit darker. This is the new colour that I've dry brushed. So it appears quite a bit lighter here, but obviously I'm not putting it on thickly. I'm just getting it on my brush. Um, I'll show you what I do. I get a bit of paint like this, and I literally rub it like this on the plate until it runs out and there's none left on the brush or virtually on uh, and then I just use this to just apply and you're just working downwards like this all the time always work downwards and then what that does is it leaves all the sort of the shadows in the underneath sections um, and I've done that on literally uh, everything like all of the scales and everything okay um, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.